So in this video we're going to go over using Keyshot with the Herberger Institute Render Farm. Now luckily Keyshot is pretty much the most straightforward application that we use with the Render Farm. Just set your file as you normally would. Click Render, just like normal. Uh, the only thing we're going to definitely change here is the Image Output folder. You can have a local folder selected, but it's preferred that you render to a network resource like the user shared drive. So in my folder I've already created a key shot folder. We'll just select that one. As you can see it's pointing to the U drive which is where you should be saving all of your render farm materials. Um, we'll bump up the resolution on this, make it something that you probably wouldn't want to render locally. Nothing too crazy but you know it's up there. And the only difference between rendering locally and network rendering with Keyshot is rather than clicking render, click send to network. You'll notice the button changes. So now click send to network. It'll do its thing. You can see the queue show up with all the other jobs that are waiting. Right now the other jobs are all done. We're the only one in the queue. Once our file uploads, there it goes. You get the added to queue down at the bottom. It means our job is successfully sitting there on the render farm rendering. We'll uh, speed this up a little bit so we're not just sitting here the whole time. Okay, our job's finished. As you can see, it only took 2 minutes and 10 seconds to do that rendering. So let's go open up our network folder. And make sure our render is there. There we go. Nice and easy.